Okay, this is going to be a quick um, trick that I just learned about in uh, Illustrator CS4. So uh, let me demonstrate it. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's um, you can take text and uh, make it 3D. But I mean, it's been done before, but. Let me just demonstrate because it just seems cooler. This time you could rotate your text like a 3D, 3D uh, object, like in one of those uh, Cinema 4D or Maya programs or 3D editing programs, etc. But um, uh, let me get a new printer. Let's just do it for the web, whatever. And I'll just leave it as the default settings. Okay. So let's see now. Oh, did I move wrong? All right. Okay. So let me just get the. Let me just show you how it's done with text first, I guess. Uh. Hello. I'm Jimmy. Okay, we cannot see that. Like literally. That's what it says. Hello, I'm Jimmy. And um, let's just highlight this. <laughs> Make it a little bit bigger because uh, whatever. Scene two seems fine. Okay, I'm gonna take this, highlight it, go to 3D. Actually, not 3D. Nope, not working either. Okay. It's kind of weird because it did yesterday. I must have missed something. But um, let's just uh, I guess yeah. Okay, now it should work. Okay, there we go. You just had to you know deselect select it with the pointer. Let's go to um, 3D extrude new bevel. And so we bring this here and let's take a look at what happens. Turn on preview, of course, so we can see it. And uh, it's a little too big. Let's bring down the depth just a little bit. Yeah. And as you can see, it's now you can move it around like a 3D um, thingy or whatever. But um, it could be you know you could put any um, font for this, and it's it's really makes it interesting, interesting uh, effect. Let me see. And uh, so it's nice. And what's also cool is that you could do um, perspective. So, say if you wanted this to one side to seem more further than the other, let's let's put this like this. Show you that happening. Then you just bring up the perspective. You got it coming towards you. See, it's like coming towards the screen. It's pretty interesting. And uh, it's a good way to edit your text, I guess. And uh, you could also change the color, or you could uh, fill, what is that? Fill like a hole in there. But um, yeah, uh, let's go to, maybe you could also change your bevel style too. Ooh, let's, anyways, undo. Let's undo that. Maybe not, we won't undo it. <laughs> let's put none. Um, where is color? I had color yesterday. This is just weird, now it doesn't show up. Not, nope. It was uh, somewhere here. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Nope. Custom rotation. Uh, whatever. More options. There we go. Okay, here is the color. You can also change your light direction, which is uh, great. The shading color. Uh, blah, whatever. Where is the color thing in Jack? Preview, blah, blah, blah. I seen it down here yesterday. Uh, whatever. Well, that's just what, um, you know. But you don't know. Let's just undo that. Uh, blah, blah. Okay, we don't need that anymore. Goodbye, goodbye. Alright. Let's take a brush tool and let's we'll draw something. Let's just uh, sign my name, I guess. No, that's not gonna work. Just because, uh, whatever. I just gotta make it a little bit more neater, anyways. Now let's try it again. Let's go to 3D, extrude and bevel, and uh, preview it. 
and uh, it's not working because I didn't select it. So let's get the arrow. Select all of it, please. Okay, now we go to Extreme Devil and preview it. There we go. Our signature is now in what you call 3D uh, preview. It's now in 3D, and uh, I just I just found that to be cool. And uh, if you already know about this, then you shouldn't be watching. But um, if you don't, this is something to add to your arsenal in Illustrator. And uh, yeah, it's just really great. You could also change the color, like I was saying yesterday. Um, custom. Okay, that's what it was. You just change the black down here and shading color to custom. And then you could change the color here. And you know, just uh, whatever. Change it to like a purple kind of craziness. Whatever. And uh, I'm not purple. I'm not Barney. But <laughs> you could change it to uh, blue or something. Nice color. Um, yeah, and you could also do the same thing with perspective. Bring it towards whatever, and uh, yeah, just pull it, pull it, pull it. Oh, it, yeah, it just kind of whatever. Uh, let's delete this, and uh, that's it. So I hope that you learned something from that, and this is my smiley face yeah whatever it's like really tight turtleneck he's wearing like really tight turtleneck yeah uh, okay I'm out of here quit can save now how do I stop this thing oh uh.